Wow. Look at this. Oh, dude, that looks awesome. I know. You guys want to try some? Yeah. No. No, dude, I'm allergic to peanuts. <laughs> You're still allergic? I thought that was a thing from when we were kids. I'm extremely allergic to peanuts, actually. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go wash up. <laughs> dude, what do you think would happen if we put some peanuts in this milkshake? I think it'd be pretty hysterical. Almost six million children under the age of 18 have food allergies. And about one third of those kids report being bullied because of their allergy. It's a growing issue in schools so huge, fellow teachers and parents have adopted a movement. You could help save a life. The Fair's It's Not a Joke campaign, created to help people learn how to stop food allergy bullying. If I'm not at school, I can't get bullied. The idea is to prevent cases like this story out of the UK. A 13-year-old teen with a severe dairy allergy suffered a serious allergic reaction and later died. This happened after he was reportedly chased and touched with cheese by a classmate. Dude, we should do it, dude. I can just crush them up right now. Yeah, we can put them right in here. Today, in this restaurant, we've got some food allergy bullies of our own. If you witness these two teens planning to put something potentially deadly into their friend's food, what would you do? Dude, when his eyes swell and his face blows up, it's gonna be hilarious pictures. Quick, quick, before he gets back. All right. <laughs> I'm putting peanuts on my ice cream. Today, our hidden cameras are rolling at the Park Avenue Diner. This is phenomenal. Dude, you gotta let me have a bite of that. Oh, yeah. Are you gonna take a bite of that? Well, now that he put the peanuts on it, no. Why not? I'm allergic to peanuts. These first customers listen in as our bullies begin to question Sam. You're still allergic? Dude, just give it a try. Yeah, let me just outgrow a peanut allergy real quick. Give me a second, guys. They're really clued in. They're not even talking to each other. Why don't you just try it? I left my phone in the car. I'm gonna go grab it, okay? After he walks away... I think we should take this. Crush it. Our bullies start to reveal their plan. Pour it in the drink, and he won't even like know that there's peanuts in it. They stay silent. Have Jordan be a little worried and say, well, you think it would hurt him? You think it would hurt him? No, it's not gonna hurt him, dude. Until... Here, we'll just put a little just bit in his milkshake, like and it'll be like... Here, here we go, here we go, here we go. I'm not gonna do that. Why not? Like, are you stupid? Like, what's wrong with you? I love these ladies. They're great. Get your little smartphone up and Google Energize and Shop. Look at us. What's the worst that can no. happen? He'll die. He'll die. Should we tell the owners? The owners? Yeah, don't do it. Or call the police. It's manslaughter. It's attempted right. murder. Bring Sam in and say, what's going on? Hey, dude. What's up? They're, they're crushing peanuts. <laughs> it's a joke. It would be a joke. First rule of medicine. You don't breathe, you die. Right? First rule. Very simple. He closes his airway, he can't breathe. He dies. Time to let him know he's safe with us. How are you? I'm John Quinones. They're all actors. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you really were amazing. Why are you so outspoken? Well, number one, we didn't want to have to treat them. Yeah, we're both medical people. Uh, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, she's a nurse. When you say we would have to trach him, what does that mean? Oh, cut an airway. Literally cut his neck. Yeah. So you know how bad it can be. Yeah. Can't open the airway. Going to Throughout the day... What's the worst that could happen? We meet more concerned customers. Do you guys want to go to prison if he dies? They lay out potential precautions. You would take management if you're feeling itchy. You know, your throat kind of flat. And the spectrum of severity. If somebody's allergic to peanuts and, and your hand is closer, yeah. you could react. Yeah. You want to crush it and put it in a drink? Smash them up. Dude, quick, before he comes back. This woman immediately steps in. There she goes, here she goes. Uh-oh. Don't touch this What's the problem? It's just a joke. But here's the thing. I'm allergic to a lot of things. Wow, wow. Allergic to the point where I have had hives. I've had my nose closed. I've literally passed out. I've had to go to the hospital. I've had to stay there overnight, and it is not fun because you think that you're gonna die. And if you're gonna have the stupid friends like you two, it's really not cool.
Bring the drink back toward them. When the boys refuse to listen. So like, just a little, no, look, no, no, just, just a little. Here she goes again. She's back on her feet. She took the drink. All right, let's go in. How are you guys? Uh, wow, this is so funny. Oh my God. I'm John Quinones. <laughs> no, you are awesome. And you took the drink away. I wouldn't want anything to happen, so you know, you gotta take it. You gotta do what you gotta do. Your message to those bullies? I guess, I mean, just because I, we are third grade teachers, for me is don't ever forget that golden rule that you learn in elementary school. Or do one to others as would be done to you. When's the last time you tried it, Pina? It's an issue that hits very close to home for this couple. You said you have allergies, Yeah, I have, I have an allergy to peanuts. Yeah, so is my grandson. And he wound up in the hospital. And he has the EpiPen shower. Well, that's him. That's not you, dude. You'd be fine. Well, I'll tell you what. I don't know if I know people that just that much. Oh, this man is great, huh? Don't tell somebody that allergies are when Sam walks away, we tell our bullies to continue. Come on, let's just take a little bit. Hey, just a little. Exactly. <laughs> this man is really serious. I really don't think he's a You're Okay, we're ready? And you think that's a big yes, joke? Yes, it is. If he drops dead, it's fun. Where was What Would You Do, the TV show? Oh, they were exactly. pretending, but you were amazing. That We wanted to see what people would say, and you were very angry. I have grandchildren that have allergies. You can. You don't know how bad it could be for the slightest amount. Do you have a picture of him? Uh, this is him? What's his name? Connor Silver. Good looking kid. He's your grandson, yeah, right? Yeah. You almost jumped out of your seat. Why get involved? Well, it's somebody's life for crying out loud. To me, that's, that's not a bully. That's a criminal offense. Profound reactions. People coming to the rescue of our food allergy victim. Sounding the alarm and possibly saving a life. Hi guys, John Quinones here. Thanks so much for checking out our YouTube channel. There's so much more to see. So click on this red button down here, the one that says subscribe, and you won't miss another What Would You Do moment. Enjoy.